Welcome to our exploration of insects. In this presentation, we will learn from MG and discover stories, poems, and learning magic as we explore insect body structure, life cycles, social behaviors, and their impact on our world. Here's what we'll cover in this video. The body structure of insects, their life cycles, the detailed stages in the butterfly life cycle, insects with three-stage life cycles, social behavior and organization, valuable lessons from insects, and the benefits and impacts of useful and harmful insects. Let's start by looking at the main body parts of insects. They include the antennae, thorax, head, legs, and eyes. Antennae act as sensory organs, detecting smells and vibrations. The thorax at the center connects the legs and wings and is key for movement. The head contains the brain, mouth parts, and compound eyes for vision. Insect legs allow them to walk, jump, or swim depending on the species. Insects have either four-stage or three-stage life cycles. We'll give an overview of these cycles, focusing especially on the butterfly stages and adult form. Some insects like butterflies, silkworms, moths, Honeybees, ants, and beetles go through four stages, egg, larva, pupa, and adult. Others, such as cockroaches, grasshoppers, and lice, have three stages, egg, nymph, and adult. The butterfly's life cycle has four main stages, egg, caterpillar, pupa, and adult butterfly. Each stage transforms the insect, with the adult stage being when the butterfly is fully developed and ready to fly and reproduce. Let's look closer at the butterfly's life cycle. The egg is laid and attached to leaves, then the caterpillar hatches, grows, and molts. Next is the pupa stage with the formation of a chrysalis and transformation, and finally the adult butterfly emerges, looking very different from the caterpillar. Adult butterflies lay eggs in clusters on the underside of leaves, using a sticky substance to keep them attached. This protects the eggs from predators and environmental challenges, by keeping them hidden and secure. The caterpillar hatches from the egg and looks very different from an adult butterfly. It eats many leaves and grows quickly, shedding its skin several times as it gets bigger. Once fully grown, the caterpillar stops eating and forms a chrysalis. Inside this protective case, it slowly changes shape during the pupa stage. After transformation, the butterfly emerges from the chrysalis. It rests while its wings dry and strengthen, and at this stage, it looks completely different from the caterpillar it once was. Now let's focus on insects that have three-stage life cycles, which include a nymph stage. The nymph stage comes between the egg and adult stages. Nymphs look similar to adults but are smaller and do not have wings. Many insects show social behaviors and live in colonies, working together for the benefit of the group. Let's see some examples. Social insects collect and share food, communicate and care for their young within large groups called colonies, supporting their complex social lives. Ant colonies include queen ants, which lay eggs and are the largest, worker ants, which are smaller and handle building, food collection and care, and soldier ants, which protect the nest from enemies. Honeybee colonies have a single large queen bee who lays eggs. Worker bees build and maintain the hive, feed larvae, collect nectar, and protect the colony. Drone bees, which are fewer and larger than workers, help with reproduction. Insects like ants and bees teach us important values such as teamwork, organization, hard work, and responsibility. Ants and bees demonstrate teamwork by helping each other and protecting their homes. They are organized into groups with specialized tasks. Their hard work is endless, and each insect responsibly contributes to the colony's success. Insects like ants, ladybirds, termites, cockroaches, and honeybees play important roles in nature and agriculture. Ants aerate soil and control pests, ladybirds protect plants from harmful insects, termites recycle deadwood, cockroaches help clean the environment, and honeybees aid in pollination, honey, and beeswax production. On the other hand, some insects can be harmful, causing disease and damage to property and crops. Houseflies and cockroaches spread disease-causing germs. Mosquitoes transmit dengue and malaria. Lice cause itching and infections. Bedbugs cause skin rashes. Termites destroy wood. And locusts damage crops and fruits. 
Insects are diverse and complex creatures essential to ecosystems and human life. Understanding their structure, life cycles, social behaviors, and impacts helps us appreciate their significance and encourages coexistence.